Irish last kicker. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring from Dublin, Ireland, Becky Lynch. What a career Becky Lynch has had so far here in WWE. Hey, listen, I remember when Becky Lynch first came to NXT, she had moved to Orlando, Florida to be a personal trainer. Never thought she'd get the opportunity to be part of this company, and now she is one of the premier superstars in our women's division. Credited with much of the women's evolution. And her opponent, first, from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. Back at NXT, Charlotte was part of a group called the Four Horsewomen with Sasha Banks, Bailey, and Becky Lynch. Wow, has Charlotte evolved from those times? Many believe Corey Charlotte is the greatest of all time. When it comes to history, making moments, capturing championships, and excelling inside the squared circle, nobody does it quite like Charlotte Flair. And you can see the respect from the WWE Universe for Charlotte. Mella is money! And from Staten Island, New York, the princess of Staten Island, Carmella! Byron, are you ready to admit the truth yet? That Carmella is the most obnoxious woman in the entire women's division? You are delusional. Mella is money. Well, that's great where you can wear blinders. Why would I want blinders on when Mella's around? So what would you know anything about how to win a title like Mella? So I see you're kissing up the Carmella as well. Why wouldn't I? I think she's an unbelievable talent. Mella is money. The contest will be fought under traditional nice. WWE triple threat rules. Well, that was an oxymoron. There's nothing traditional about a triple threat match. What a clothesline! Ouch! Jam your leg in a bad way. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyperextend your elbow. Enziguri! At 2016's Clash of Champions, it was another classic triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship. It was Bailey versus the boss, Sasha Banks, versus the champion, Charlotte Flair. The match started out more like a singles match between the boss and the queen. Bailey learned very quickly it was every woman for herself. The triple threat match for the Raw Women's Championship was another example of the incredible competition between the female superstars of WWE. Charlotte was physically dominant in fighting off the challenges of Bailey and Sasha Banks. At one point, the Queen even landed a moonsault on both their opponents at the same time. But the boss and Bailey put it all on the line and kept fighting. There were several near pinfalls during this battle, but in the end, as it should be, the Queen exhibited her genetic superiority by fighting off both her challengers. At Locked in! 
It's locked in. That creates a big opening here. The smartest thing a young star can do is learn from a veteran. And Charlotte has the best in the wrestling business. The Nature Bowl. She works her way out of the hole. And I don't know how. That was locked in pretty good. What does Becky Lynch have to do at this point to stay in the match? Corey Charlotte's knowledge of the game is limitless thanks to Rick. When you're running from the Nature Boy, it's like an advanced class every day. Imagine having Flair DNA to start. Then you add the wisdom of Ric Flair and the sky is the limit. She's already Hall of Fame worthy and she's only getting better. Oh, what a snap there. Oh, perfectly executed. she keep her down the superstar always needs to be ready to be attacked by both opponents in a triple threat match Carmella is in position she is on fire thank you Lynch the backsploder I think this is the beginning of the end Michael bang a competitor must be ready for the possibility that they'll fall victim to a two-on-one attack on a triple threat match. A great example of that is the triple threat match on SmackDown Live between AJ Styles, Dolph Ziggler, and Baron Corbin. Wow. No one thought that Ziggler and Styles would work together to perform a double dive off the barricade that put Corbin through the Spanish announce table. And that's exactly what a superstar always needs to have in the back of their mind. That at some point, their two opponents will most likely join together and take them out. It's one of here we go. Bam! There is no coming back from that one. One thing nobody could ever take away from Carmella is that she will forever be known as the first ever. Thank you, Lynch. Got the disarmor. She can end it here. All that's left now is for Becky Lynch to finish. Leave it to Saxton to call Carmella's money in the bank victory. No, she escapes it. Yeah, I don't know if she had it locked in fully, Michael. Beautiful technique. Oh, this is not good at all. The targeting the back, very effective. What's oh, coming by next? The shoulders. Oh, uh -oh. no. Right to the jaw. Oh, oh, you can pick up your teeth in section one. We've got to cover. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? Wow. Becky's showing some serious heart right there, and she's still alive. And Charlotte was able to get out of danger there. Lucky for her. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Oh. Look at this. The ref's out. No good can come of this, Michael. Oh, man, that's how you put an exclamation point on the end of a match, guys. Come on, this isn't fair. Life's not fair, Cole. Get over it. I've seen countless triple threat matches over the years, and I can confidently say that this one ranks right up there with some of the all-time best. Yeah, I love the effort here, but she'd better hope she can sustain it. It's a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. Charlotte with the spear! I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. She goes for the cover. One, two, three! Yes! Unreal performance! No doubt that was a match people will be telling their kids about for years to come. Here's another look. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match as entertaining and action-filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. I could watch highlights of that one all night long. One of the great WWE matches I've ever been able to watch. This entire match was just one big highlight reel, and I didn't expect anything else. Here is your winner, 
Charlotte Flair. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a very big win here tonight. Simply put, she wanted it more than the other two did tonight. And folks, if you're just joining us, I'm sorry to tell you that you just missed one of the most exciting SmackDown matches in recent memory.